Winter is fast approaching in Moscow. The shortages of summer, such as bread and cigarettes, now threaten to expand to tragic proportions as the deep Russian freeze settles on this capital city. Warehouses hold but a fraction of the food reserves they normally stock this time of year. Russians stand in long lines and fight their way through crowded street shops to spend a few scarce kopecks for a piece of white or brown bread. Most Soviets, from the street sweepers all the way up to the top levels of government, are worried that disaster lies ahead unless radical changes are made and soon. Recently, we covered a meeting between Soviet President Mikhail Gorbachev and New York Stock Exchange Chairman John Phelan. But, as one observer noted, the Soviets are more preoccupied with stocking their markets than marketing stocks. Economic development in the Soviet Union is a long-term prospect no one is predicting an easy solution to the many problems here. But everyone is looking for a sign, some ray of hope that life will get better. On the horizon, all I can see for now is a dark cloud heralding the long winter ahead. In Moscow, Steve Vampa, Eyewitness News.